More answers about a tragic crash in Pasco County. Two children sent to the hospital and three people, including this couple, died last night. Tonight, ABC Action News reporter Andrea Lyon found out improper passing might have played a role in that crash. Dennis is the life of the party, no matter where he went. All it took was a matter of seconds. He is a father, his son Landon, and his son Tyler, the lights of his life. And Betty Barrett Wilkes' life turned upside down. You'd never expect that he would be killed in a car accident. Her 38-year-old son drove trucks for a living, but this time he was on the road for fun. He never misses a game. Driving home from his son's soccer game, his girlfriend Christina Farmer in the passenger side seat. According to FHP, it was raining hard when another car decided to pass on County Road 54, hitting the Polk County couple head on. Why would you? Why would you pass when it's raining like that? I don't even pass when the sun is out. Troopers say it is a legal passing lane when safe, but at this time it was pouring. Data shows eight people have already died this year during improper passing situations. In all of the Tampa Bay area, more than 800 crashes involving drivers who shouldn't have been passing in turn hit another car. It's not worth it. I'm not in that big a hurry ever. In Polk County, Andrea Lyon, ABC Action News.